Hello my friends and welcome to Flying Circus Models. This is the first part of my new project so with one one and a half strutter from Rodin at the cockpit. I purchased this model as soon as it was available online. As usual I selected a Ukrainian store and I encourage everyone to buy from Ukrainian online shops because they really need to do business during this wartime. When I opened the box, uh, I found uh, a small surprise with Ukrainian candies and uh, a story of Mr. Paki. Even though it's a brand new model with new molds, Rodin keeps the same quality of the plastic, has some burn spruce uh, and details. Some parts uh, were damaged, uh, but not because of the transportation, I think. Uh, they were packed and sealed with not enough care. You can find the pinholes uh, on the inner halves uh, of the fuselage that will have to be removed. Decal sheet has two options, both from Arnas and uh, a standard black and white instruction. Very interesting moment uh, that a box art uh, for this model is exactly the same as for their strutter in 148 scale. As usual, first things first, we need to remove major cockpit parts from the sprue and clean them.
After I removed all pins that are on the inside of both fuselage halves, I didn't use a putty and cover them with the super glue instead. Once glue dried, I sanded it with 600 grit sandpaper. When all parts were ready for painting, I covered all of them with Mr. Surfacer 1000 primer. After all wooden and linen parts were painted with Mr. Hobby Sales color as a base. To paint wood on the floor, struts, dashboard and other wooden parts, I used my usual technique with the oil paints. I used rough sienna and hard dry flat brush. To make the internal rigging, I marked and drilled uh, small holes uh, in the top corners of each vertical strut.
Then I include resin turnbuckles type A from Gas Patch Models and covered all details um, with the layer of feature. To add some used effect um, and add uh, more depth, uh, I applied a black wash on uh, inner fuselage sides, then removed all extras. The next step is rigging. Uh, the same technique uh, as usual. I used easy line thread, glued the bottom piece to the fuselage, put the thread through the 0.5 mm piece of medical needle, then through the turn buckle and fixed with the super glue. The front rigging is uh, doubled on both sides, so I added one more turn buckle and the line. Because turn buckles are resin, they are not painted, so I used Mr. Metal color brass uh, to paint them. The instrument panel was painted in wood, as I said before, and um, the kit doesn't have any decals for instruments. So I used Aeroscale aftermarket decals and some leftovers from my previous projects. And here's the hint of the day, do not throw away any unused decals, 
they may be useful in your future projects. Extra cockpit parts were painted as well and I added a twisted uh, copper wire as an imitation of the air brake chain. Armorounds were painted black and uh, I used the dry brush technique to show the edges and used effect. Then I glued them into the ammo boxes on the floor. Because it's their damn kit, it uh, doesn't have any photo H parts um, uh, and seat belts, so I also used leftovers from another kit and painted them with the lining color. Then I attached uh, rudder pedals, a wooden floor and control stick and made uh, control cables uh, from pedals. Then I glued the main gas tank that was between a pilot and observer slash rear gunner. The air brake parts had to be attached to the lower wing. But it doesn't fit and I had to remove those plastic pins. Also, I used a round file to send the plastic. The final step was to paint seat and glue seat belts and the cockpit is ready to be closed. As usual, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, press like button and leave your comments below. I read and reply to all of them. Also, if you would like to support my channel, you can do it on Patreon, where you can see my videos early. Also, I share some interesting pictures there. The link is in the description. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episodes.